Here he is. Let's pick up whatever that is. Oh. Pick up these. All right, two beautiful people of the interwebs, Glyn here, Cheapskate Gaming, and we're going to check and look on Wonderful World of Games. We've got a nice simple one here, nothing too complicated, nice easy pick up and play type game, and it's called Iron Fistical. And that sounds quite pain painful actually, doesn't it, an Iron Fistical? But uh, the game isn't painful at all, it's actually, it's quite a nice little um, sort of bullet hell. We'll skip this intro thing, not much going on there. So essentially it gives you a little maze of dungeons and it's a little bit like a um, little bit of gauntlet going on here, the old school gauntlet. And I'm trying to remember the other game it reminds me of. Hades, and in Robotron they achieve perfection. So essentially you're killing all the bad guys, picking up the goodies. Um, the chests have uh, power-ups. Not sure what the sun power up did. Um, and then you've got your special move, which is your iron fistical, which I will press now. And that's your iron fistical. Oof. And as you can see, it's quite a powerful move. It takes out the enemies, um, which is kind of like your last ditch attempt going on there. Oh, we've got to level up. All right, my weapon leveled up. Pick up Shrieken. And essentially this is what, oh, that's a new weapon. Flamethrower, like it. We pick up the heart, and then when you pick up the heart, you've got two different ways to go. Here we go. We go up, and essentially you've got to get to the eyeball at the end, which is like your boss. It'll be the boss. So I think we'll get to the first boss, and then I'll tell you how much you can pick this up for. And of course, this is cheapskate gaming, and as we know, you're not going to be paying much for it. And again, this is going to be from Aniba. Uh, my favourite sort of go-to. There are some good deals on Fanatical. Actually, I should have really put a Fanatical deal on just to balance things up, but maybe I'll do a Fanatical deal tomorrow. Um, there we go. Let's keep smashing these out. Pick up the heart. Right, we'll get this chest. Oh. Uh, I think I'll pause it, because I think we'll show you how much. I'm not going to spend too long on this video. It's a pretty simple uh, style game. And like I said, we're getting it from Aniba. Don't worry about the £2.90. We're not doing it for £2.90. We're coming down here. We got it for 52 pence. Now, I know the screen isn't as big as I normally have it. Um, just to forewarn you, if you up the display, not the display resolution, what's it called? The um, scaling. The, some games don't work very well with scaling, and this is one of them. It doesn't like being scaled. So um, I had to put my scale back down to 100% to play it. But here we are, 52 pence. I should be able to pick it out. If not, I'll zoom in on um, post-processing, as you can see. 52p, 54p, 64p. So, um, yeah, we'll get that out of the way. Go back to the game. Um, and, of course, I'm using controller. I always try to, if I can use a controller, I will. And like I say, we'll try and get to the first boss. And then, uh, although I'm not doing very well at the minute, I'm about to die. Elf is about to die. Um, oh, pick up this heart. That will like to make me feel a bit better. What is this thing shooting at me? Right, let's get out of here. You'll be careful of these these guys. They're a bit um, these knights that appear. They uh, they don't like you very much. Um, we'll go up and then we we'll go right afterwards. Oh, bonus level. I didn't show you these, like. So essentially, it's like a side runner. You don't, you, you don't, you're not in control of the um, movement. You basically got to keep up with the screen. Uh, you're just basically collecting coins. Oh, oh I got squished. Oh, we failed that one. Okay, no matter. That doesn't come to the end of your run. Oh, I don't like that skull and thing over there. Let's go and get the uh, the treasure trash. See how many of these we can take out. Not 
doing too bad. Got a bit of health back. I don't know if you can shoot these skulls. Yes, you can. Good. Let's shoot these skulls out of the way. Pick up this. Get me shurikens on the go. Something shooting at me. Kill the thing that's shooting at me. Probably pop and take that. And take that as well. Right, where's the Scott? Where's the key? Oh, I've got to get this last thing, have I? Oh, I have as well. Oh, I want that. Oh, you're not going to get me. Right, not far now. We get to the boss on the next level, and then that'll be me done. I don't think I'm going to get past this. These are hard, these levels. Oh, you bugger. These are called graveyards, I think, these levels. They're a bit harder. Oh, definitely want that. Oh, is a fistical? Ah, oh, I missed the iron fistical. Oh, don't like him. Oh. Ooh. Right. Let's believe this is the boss. So, this is. Let's get some hearts. Here he is. Let's pick up whatever that is. Oh. Pick up these then. Sarikans will be good. Oh. Oh, I haven't got any fisticles left. Made a big error of judgment there. Ah. Oh. There we are, and that's it, I died. Anyway, it's been Iron Fistical. Nice little quick pick-up and play game. Like I say, what was it? 50-something pence, wasn't it? Uh, 52 pence, there we go. Anyway, you've been watching Glynn, Cheapskate Gaming, Wonderful World of Games, Iron Fistical, and we're out of here. Goodbye now. Cheapskate Gaming, yeah, you know the name. They got the games that won't break the bank, so come on over and join the crew. They'll show you. They'll show you. How to game and save money too Cheapskate Gaming, yeah, you know the name They got the games that won't break the